Peace be to you. The Gospel today invites us to reflect on the important decalogue, Thou shall not kill. It was an outward forbidden law that when one kills the other one, he was subject to punishment, criminal punishment. And Jesus takes this Decalog law and brought it to the daily ordinary life of an Israelite. How this law could be used on the daily life of a person? And he had reflected and God went to the root of that killing. How that person led to the place of killing? It is by anger. When a person harbors anger in terms of jealousy and vengeance, when har anger harbored for longer days, it comes out of a person as human actions of killing. Jesus tells us the very moment you start to harbor these kind of evil things, you are on the path of killing other person. So, Jesus invites us to strike at the root of the anger and killing. So, we, have, we are invited to strike at the root. The second one is that when you are coming to the altar of God, and happen to feel that you have some grudge against your brother, it is an integrity on yourself placing the worshipping things on the way, go to the brother and get reconciliation with him. Without that, your offering will become waste. Not only that, your brother will take you to the court and he will be put into prison. So, let us have a good relationship, making peace, making forgiveness. When we make peace and forgive the other one, there will be no necessity of law for forbidding a person from killing. So, let us in a special way change internally accepting our own and accepting the other one. Heavenly Father, we thank and praise you for all the gifts you have showered upon us. Thank you, Lord, for this beautiful day. Be with us, Lord. Strengthen us, heal us, for we are your children. Many a time, Lord, we arbor so many evil things in our hearts. And finally, it reaches out to the evil actions. Be with us, so that we may strike, strike at the root of the penury. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen.